Are you having a hard time finding the skull on the map nine? If you've tried everything and can't find that blasted skull, you're in the right place, my friend. I've got you covered. My name is Calhoun92, and today I'm going to be explaining to you how to find that skull that's needed for the nine Easter egg. Now, I do got to say, guys, if you just want a quick video on the locations of all the skulls, go ahead, click the video I have linked in the description below. That being said, this video is going to focus on the settings you need for Black Ops 4 Zombies to complete the main Easter eggs. Unlike other iterations of Zombies, there are more settings in this one, so Treyarch kind of had to lock you out of doing the Easter eggs if you had certain settings chosen. So anyways, let's get right into that, guys. Now, before we actually get into the gameplay section of this video, we need to talk about the settings that you need to have your game set to if you want to find the skull and complete the Easter egg. And I do gotta say, it's not just the skull that you need this for. These settings are very important if you wanna complete any Easter egg in the game. The very first thing I want you guys to do is make sure you're playing online. Unfortunately, in this iteration of Zombies, you cannot play locally or offline. That was possible in the other Zombies games, but it is not in Black Ops 4. So yeah, that's tip number one. Make sure you are playing online. The next thing I'm going to say, guys, is make sure you're playing on at least normal difficulty. You cannot be playing on casual difficulty if you want to complete the Easter egg, find the skull, etc, etc. There's been so many people I've talked to that have not been able to complete the Easter egg, only to find out that all they needed to do was change the difficulty on their game. So yeah, make sure you're not playing on casual, make sure you're playing on normal, and make sure you're playing online. All right, so the next tip I'm gonna give you guys is make sure you're not playing in custom mutations. Now, I think this was a huge missed opportunity by Treyarch. We could have had some really cool Easter egg completions if we could have used custom mutations. I get why we weren't able to use them, but anyways, yeah, you cannot be using custom mutations if you want to complete the Easter egg. Another quick little note on the custom mutations, you also cannot be using bots when you're trying to complete the Easter egg. This one is really unfortunate. With the addition of bots in Black Ops 4 Zombies, I was really hoping we'd be able to attempt the Easter egg with the bots. I felt like it would be really cool to complete that Easter egg using the bots. It could have made the game a lot more accessible for those playing solo. But anyways, make sure you're not using bots or on custom mutations while you're trying to complete the main Easter egg. So yeah, if you guys are still having a hard time finding the skull, make sure you're playing online, make sure you're playing on at least normal difficulty, and make sure you're not playing in custom mutations. Now the last thing I'm going to say is an in-game thing is make sure Pack-a-Punch is open, because the skull doesn't actually spawn into the game unless the Pack-a-Punch is open. That's pretty obvious at this point, but I'm just going to throw that out there. So for the last part of this video, I'm just going to give you guys a quick demonstration on how I find the skull, you know, the areas I look first of all, and then kind of the secondary areas. So this is me going into the temple, opening up Pack-a-Punch, and then I'm going to start looking for the skull. Now my genuine recommendation is kind of do just a circle around all these different areas. You can't really do a true circle, but check out these four spots on each side. and then check kind of these middle areas here. There's been so many times, guys, that I have almost missed this skull. This thing is super easy to miss, so make sure your brightness is turned up in your game, on your TV, on your monitor, whatever you're using. And yeah, just kind of go in this weird circle around looking in all these areas. Go to the other video if you still can't find them. But if you've done all the settings I told you about, you should be good to go. Go ahead, find that skull, complete the Easter egg, and have a good day, my friends. Thank you so much for watching this video. Please leave a like. Subscribe if you want more videos like this. Until next time, guys, this has been Calhoun92. I will see you in the very next video.